Today, we are traveling to Saudi Arabia's Al Juf region, where a consortium of Emirati and French companies are developing Dumat Al Jandal, a 400 megawatt wind park set to begin operations in the first quarter of 2022. Recently, the 500 billion US dollars, which is 1.9 billion Saudi rials worth project, reached a financial close with funds being secured from Saudi Arabian as well as international banks. So what is Dumat Al Jandal? Who is developing this project in the kingdom? And which companies have won works for the upcoming wind park? Let's find out. Welcome to a brand new episode of Construction Week in Focus Season 3. I am Ranju Warrior, reporter at Construction Week. Located 896 kilometers north of Riyadh, in the Al Juf region of Saudi Arabia, the 400 megawatt Dumat Al Jandal wind park is being developed by a consortium of French renewable energy firm EDF Renewables and Abu Dhabi future energy company also called as Mastar. After a call for tenders was announced in August 2017, the Emirati French consortium was awarded the project in January 2019 by Renewable Energy Project Development Office, which is a part of Saudi Arabia's Ministry of Energy, Industry and Mineral Resources. Dumat Al Jandal is touted as the largest wind farm in the Middle East and the first in Saudi Arabia. Construction work on the wind park is imminent with operations set to begin in the first quarter of 2020, according to the Emirates News Agency. Once operational, Dumat Al Jandal will produce electricity under a 20-year power purchase agreement with Saudi Power Procurement Company. Earlier this month, an engineering, procurement and construction contract, which is an EPC contract for the wind park, was awarded to Danish firm Vestas for the supply and installation of wind turbines at Dumat Al Jandal. Speaking about the contract win at that time, President of Vestas Mediterranean, Edurado Medina said that the order had marked the first phase of Saudi Arabia's plan to install 7 gigawatts of wind capacity within 5 years and 16 gigawatts by 2030. The Emirati French JV had also picked India's CG Power and Industrial Solutions, which is a part of New Delhi-based Avanta Group company, to design and build a high-voltage substation that will connect Saudi Arabia's national electricity transmission grid to the wind park under a 14 million US dollars contract. The Dumat Al Jandal Wind Park project comes in line with Saudi Arabia's aim to localize the production of renewable energy as part of its Vision 2030 economic diversification plans. That's all from us about the Dumat Al Jandal Wind Park, which once developed will boost the kingdom's renewable energy production. If you want us to check out more projects in the region, please let us know by commenting in the comments box below. Also, don't forget to hit the like button and share the video with your friends and colleagues if you enjoyed watching it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with our videos. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.